Okay, so the next feature I wanted to go over is um, how to attach notes and documents to various transactions and master records. So an example here would be if I wanted to go into sales invoices. So this is just looking up a sales invoice that was entered. So there's this fact box at the right hand side here that shows attachments and notes. So this is, um, this will, this is, you can do this feature in uh, not just sales invoices, but other transactional windows and even master record windows. You can attach documents and notes. So the first one is uh, attachments. So I'll just show you how to do that. You just click this zero icon and then select your file. I'll just add this sample file. So as you can see, it's been added and you can continue adding uh, more files here. And then once you're done, you just click close and then it'll turn into one. So once this is posted, it'll always live with the document. So this is a good way to, if you're, if you're planning to go paperless in your organization, um, you don't have to print your documents anymore and file them away. Um, this is a good feature to do there. Another way you can use this is if you have a journal entry. Uh, so you can do this in general journals as well, um, attach documents so that uh, for, for future audit purposes, there, there's a quick way to get some background on um, various transactions. The next one is notes. So that's pretty self-explanatory there. So if you click plus there, you can add a note and then press OK. And then it'll actually have a date stamp and the user that, that added that note. So you can even continue adding more notes. Um, if you are a different user or if you're the same user, you can continue adding notes and it'll have that history there. Okay, so that's, that's a good feature there to kind of give a history on what's been happening with this transaction or this vendor. Um, you can continue adding notes there.